Good morning, folks. We've had three significant solar flares, but none of them produce CMEs. Definitely not at Earth, but they do represent a solar watch for the rest of the week. Let's stay here and move to 193 angstroms, where it will be just as hard to spot those flares as it was in the opening. Filaments have been stable as well, a nice change from last week. So let's go to the X-ray flare chart. You can see the three larger spikes on the right, all impulsive, so they didn't produce CMEs, as we've said, and only two of them came from the incoming limb. First, it was the X-class flare we saw in last night's video. Then a couple hours later, as we speed up, another from down there at the limb. Speeding up once again, bringing us to this morning, it was those Earth-facing sunspots that fired, and if you recall, we had said yesterday morning that those might be flaring by nighttime. There we go. Sunspots still growing as they cross center longitudes and begin departing. Two quick articles here. First is a throwback to the stuff hiding in plain sight. Our cosmology coverage in years past focused on how much they didn't see and how it would be regular matter they continuously discovered rather than dark matter, and that in general. They don't always know what they're looking at, like this one. Believed to be a distant galaxy millions and millions of light years away? Nope, just a star out in the large Magellanic Cloud, basically part of our own galactic system. Taking a moment to update the solar cycle progression, we are still way, way above forecasted marks. The best case scenario given what's happened so far is a double peaked cycle rather than a single peaked curve that hits higher levels of flaring. And even if we get that double peak, we're almost surely going to go higher than we went last sunspot cycle as Zarkova's GSM dreams continue to melt away. Folks, personal moment sharing frustration. Obviously, we have been throttled, censored, and walk on thin ice here on YouTube. Our website plugin company just up and quit earlier this year, so we had to find another one. The app services and data feeds keep changing and have plenty of issues. And now, Cells has been bought by Amazon and will shut its doors at the end of June. It's a move made to force small businesses to use Amazon, pay them more money. We are not happy about it, learned about it on the day our new hats arrived, including epic cardinal red flat bills. Folks, whether it's a hat, shirt, one of our six available books, or something else, Cells closes at the end of June, and while we will try to find an alternative, it appears Amazon has apparently been cleaning house in the online game, and we don't know when anything will be available starting July 1. We greatly appreciate your support. Get our gear at otf.cells.com while we can. We've got shots of our star to close. Subscribe, and we'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now, it's 5.45 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.